Welcome to group stage game number two, KC Legends vs. Kansas Rush. KC Legends coming off a win last night. Rush, this being their first game in this tournament. And we're off. And it's Broderick Nolan through the middle. Quick shot off a defender. Ball's cleared out. Loke Deschler is there to continue the attack. Plays forward, but intercepted. Challenged here by Nolan. Ball played to the middle. Shuttler looks to kick it out to the left. Back to Flores. Dotty back to Shuttler, who tries to explore the left wing. Beats a man, plays it back to the middle. Back to Shuttler. Cleared out to the right to Nolan. Nolan battling with Caleb, number 10 there. Once again, 10 on 10. And, oh, ball is called out of bounds. Typically, the ball would need to clear the entire out of bounds line. But possession to rush. Intervention there by Nolan. A brilliant idea with the cross. But we've got a whistle. This is going to be a back pass. If you pass the ball directly back to your keeper and they pick it up, that will be a free kick. Now, this will be an indirect free kick, meaning you cannot shoot directly on the goal. Someone needs to touch the ball first before they could shoot. Likely what's going to happen here is we'll see Nolan with a quick touch. Then someone else will take a shot. One touch. Shot by Flores. Dottie's blocked. And going to be out for a goal kick. Oh, is this going to be a corner? No, it will be a co corner. Ball went off a defender. Dashler to take the corner. Straight to the keeper and collect it. Ball's punted out. Rush player. Cherry picking from midfield and offsides is called. Now, this may have been a bad call. You cannot be offside on your half of the field. If he would have stepped over the midline before the punt, he would have been offsides. But all the same, offsides called. And now we have a rush throw in on their own half. Rush with the ball here on their own half. Looks to clear. Stop by Shuttler. Bouillette back to Shuttler. Played in but collected by the defense. Clearance goes nowhere and still battled for it. Dot Flores Dotty. Ball in the legends half for the first time today. Ooh, taken away. Push forward. But Deschler and Shuttler collapse on the ball. And now the ball is going to be out for a Legends goal kick. Carmine Springfield in goal will play it out. Out to Shuttler on the left side, looking for a path forward. Stops, pinned in. Beats his man on an L turn. Loses possession. On the attack, a shot, and it's collected by Springfield. Ball's punted out right back to... Ooh, great touch there by Reed. Nolan with the ball on the right. Beats his man. Looks for an option down the right wing. Cuts back, and we're going to be out for a goal kick. Well, again, this is the first game for Rush in this tournament. Legends already with three points. Rush will play Sporting Caw Valley tonight at 8 p.m. Of course, by the time I'm recording this, that game's already taken place. Rush won that game 2-1. to one. Goal kick to goal kick, and Rush will have possession here. Intercepted here by Nolan, right in front of goal. Nolan shoots great tackle there by Rush to stop what was likely an inevitable opener there for Broderick Noland. 
Nolan presses again, working hard in these first few minutes. Throw in. Every rush attempt seems to be met with some form of response by Legends, and the ball remains in Rush's half as it has for most of this game so far. Just five minutes into this first half. Clint inside out to Reed. Benton Reed plays the ball forward, but will be collected by the keeper. Punt goes out, stopped by Shuttler. Shuttler pushes the ball forward down the left wing. Ooh, thought he had an attack, but went a little too wide and out of touch. Will be Rush's ball. Rush slowly working to move the ball into Legends half. Out of touch again, but another throw. Throw a little too far past his attacker. Cleared out there by Legends. Ball stopped by Flores. Dottie stopped again, and now Nico's on the attack. Cuts to the middle. Good challenge there. Now it's Booyat on the left side. Cuts back to the middle. And things with Rush always get physical. Oh, they, they say still in bounds there. Reed steps two. And the ball cleared out past the Legends defensive line. Destro's back to collect, and the ball will fall out of bounds. Deschler a little slow to get up. Ref checks on him, but I think he's going to be all right. No. The sub's coming on here, so Deschler's going to take a breather along with a few of his teammates. Great to see Adrian Maroff back out there, uh, returning home from a trip to Florida or uh, California. Nice to see him back on the pitch, especially um, after playing through a nagging injury. Archer Perkins uh, has decided to take a little bit of time off with a uh, playing through a nagging ankle injury. Uh, him being an extremely tough kid, did not want to stop playing, but. We hope we hope he uh, recovers and feels better soon. Speaking of Maroff, challenges here. Rush trying to get an attack going in the Legends box for the first time in the game. The ball's going to be out for a corner kick. Coach Michael Hanna, you see there. In his second game coaching this squad. Attack here by Rush. The shot goes in. For a brief moment there was opportunity but snuffed out by Springfield. And now it's Maroff trying to take the ball out of his own end. Cleared out by Rule. If nothing else you can count on the power of Luke Rule's leg to get you out of trouble. And he does there. It's going to be a rush goal kick, but the danger for the moment averted. Subs coming on for rush. Almost nine minutes gone in the first half, still scoreless. Here's Benton Reed at midfield. Does not give an inch. Oh, ping pong, but here's Deschler on the right side, may have an option. Looks to get by his man, back to goal. Ball's cleared out here. Mar off to give chase. Tripped up by it. Still loose in his own box. And here's Rule to take the danger away yet again.
Oh, and when the flag is up for an illegal throw, is the bugaboo of these kids. No, no, we've blown the whistle there, Benton. The bugaboo for these kids is keeping both feet down on that throw. You can't lift a foot up. It's bound to happen a few times per game. Ball's out for another Legends throw here. Uh-oh. Counter-attack. Rush has numbers. A shot from the outside blocked by Knighton. And here's Rule. Pass one man. Looks for a clearance. Maroff's there. Clearance after clearance. Ball stuck in the midfield. Here's Shuttler. Shuttler pushes forward. Double team. Taken down. No whistle. Ball still free. Benton Reed. Loose in the back of the net. Benton Reed. Dangerous. Ambidextrous. Look out for him. Makes it 1-0 Legends. Ten minutes into the game. Rush looks to quickly take the kickoff. Shuttler got on a run there, tripped up on the double team, arguably a foul. But after that, the loose ball collected by Reed. And if Benton's one on one with the keeper, you're probably putting a goal on the board. Here's Deschel on the right side, looking to strike while the iron's hot. Cross goes in, cleared out. The box cleared out by rule and goes to the left side of the flag so it's going to be a throw in here for Rush throw in stopped off by Deschler immediately tries to push the counter learned something very valuable today that we were a little too close with the camera and can't see exactly what's going on in the bottom of the shot throw in here challenged by Deschler clearance is stopped off by rule place forward to Reed all cleared out Knighton's there and here's Charlie Knighton one man to beat and the ball's taken and Rush trying to mount an attack here, but really has struggled to move the ball past midfield. Oh, we got the whistle blown. We're going to have a free kick on the outside of the box. Another nine inches in, and that would have been a PK. But if the foul occurs outside of that black box, then the free kick is going to take place at that point. If it's four feet in, we put the ball in the spot right in front of the keeper. Free kick goes in right to Deschler. Clearance intercepted by Shuttler. Here's Shuttler moving down the middle. Oh, ball is cleared out. Rory is completely confused by why that wasn't a foul. It what? Trust me, Rory. If when you got actually tackled, it wasn't a foul. That one. Definitely wasn't a foul. They're letting them play soccer in this game. You gotta applaud the refs for that. Clearance here to the middle. Once again stopped off, this time by Maroff. Maroff's attack snuffed out for the moment. subs coming on here
Throwing collected by Rush. Challenge there by Nico, but another throw is coming up. And immediately, well, this Rush coach is going to teach us how to do a throw in and remind all the boys how to do it. I'm saving you all the audio right now. Probably doing him a favor by piping over the crowd noise. Punt stopped off by Nolan. Speculative shot, but blocked. Here's Nolan again, moving through the middle. Now Knighton. Knighton into the attacking half of the ball's free. Oh, not quite enough room or time to get the shot off. Maroff battling for the ball at midfield. Rule and Bouillette helping. The ball centered, but straight to the defense, back outside. Players go to ground, no call. Play on, says the ref. Bouillette challenges, takes the ball, cuts back to the middle. Looks for a pass to Knighton, but it's intercepted. Intercepted once again by Nolan. Here's Knighton. Cuts past one man. Ball goes free. We got another clearance. Goes straight to the chest of Flores Dottie. More of the same. Rush attempting to play long balls and clearances, but are continually stopped in the midfield by legends. This one through for the moment, but no one gets around him. Past the defender. Cuts back to the middle. Maradona inside the box. Here's Broderick Nolan with the cross to the feet of Maroff. Maroff shoots and off a defender. A great sequence there for the Legends. Does not yield a goal. And I think we're going to have a foul called. Or if the flag was up, possibly. May have had an offside there. Clearance to the near side. Poked free by Flores Dotti. And Nico slowing this game down. Really great defensive awareness by Nico in this game so far. And by all all the legends, frankly. One to zero is still the score here. We're about seventeen or eighteen minutes into this twenty five minute first half. I see the wind picking up. Off the face of Flores Dotti. Are they going to call a header? They may have called a header there, which are illegal for two more years for these boys. Free kick taken towards the middle off the foot of Bouviet and cleared out by Nolan. Nico cuts back to the middle. Ball into the box here. A forward ball, but nobody there for Rush, and Bouillette's going to chase it down. Bouillette clears forward. Maroff with the ball. Challenged. It's going to be out for a Legends throw. Looks like we have another legal throw. This one will go back to Rush. Here's Nolan. Shocked off the ball. And the ball cleared out to the middle, but Nico's there. Pass is intercepted. Through ball taken back by Legends. And another clearance. Bit of a rough patch of soccer here this last minute and a half. All out for another rush throw.
Pressure on the goal kick back to Maroff. Maroff takes a shot past the keeper in the net. Adrian Maroff right off the beach into the scoring column where he's used to being. 2-0 Legends. 21 minutes gone in the first half. A two-goal lead over Kansas Rush, something this team has never enjoyed before. Well, that's not true. I don't know why I said that. That happened before in the 2-2 draw on this very field. Now on the restart, stolen by Nolan, shot by Bouillette, and almost... A third goal before I could stop talking about the second. It's going to be a corner kick. 2-0. Blood in the water for the Legends. Looking for a third. Ball's free. Shot by Bouillette. Goes over the crossbar. Martin Bouillette last night tested the goal again and again and again. Even missing a penalty. Ultimately scoring the winner in a 4-3 win. Martin Bouillette has been on fire lately. And looks to be heating up here in the late first half. Ball out for a goal kick here. Move there by the rush defender. Moving out of his own half. The ball's going to be out for a legend's throw. Rory looks to take it quick. Clearance. No one's there. Shoots. Saved by the rush keeper. Goal kick to midfield. Going to be stopped off. No one's there. Plays the ball to the center, but no one's home. Nico challenges, and that will be a free kick. Although not explicitly stated in the FIFA rulebook, you cannot throw another player to the ground. Sometimes you can. No one's here to take the free kick. Shot just goes wide and out for a goal kick. About 23 minutes gone here in the first half. About two minutes remaining until halftime. 2-0 Legends. Rush looking to build an attack here. Forward ball. He's got an attacker on the edge of the Legends box, but Reed intercepts it. Shuttler attempts to help out with the clearance, but the trouble is not done. Into the box. Ball poked free there by Benton Reed for a rush throw. Lately in games, Legends have been prone to conceding those late half goals. That if it can really change the complexion of a game, the difference between going in halftime at 2-0 or giving up a goal can be huge. Long punt there from Springfield and collected by the rush keeper. Rush keeper returns the favor back out to Carmine. And that one will also go out of touch, but this one for a rush throw. There's no one. In the box, shoot, saved. Oh, it's a loose ball. Nico tries to follow it, but just goes wide. Broderick Nolan also knocking on the door several times over. Will he break it down? Rush left side, look for a long ball. Played off the middle here, challenged by Reed. Great tackle there by Dashler. The attacking teams on the left side now fully cleared out by Z-Man. There'll be a rush throw here. 
now 25 minutes gone you know now in what's considered stoppage time really the end of the half comes down to the discretion of the keeper or of the of the ref shot goal I spoke it into existence an attack that just lasted too long yields a loose ball a one on one and Rush pulls within one and there's the whistle for half time alright welcome to the second half Rush getting it started here in the second half Two to one is the score. Legends lead. And Rush immediately trying to get that equalizer. In a tournament like this, a single point from a game like this can mean everything. As only two teams will progress to the final. You do not have to win the group to get an advantage. All you have to do is progress. So the difference between winning and, and well, losing and drawing is huge. Ball challenged there by Charlie Knighton. It's a good strategy there sometimes to try to take a quick throw even if you know it's going to belong to the other team. Anything to waste a few seconds when you're up can sometimes be helpful. Here's Rush challenged by Shuttler. Shuttler passes his man on the left side and he's going to roll down the wing. Looks to cut back. Crosses to the middle. He's got Reed. The touch is a little too strong though and Rush will have the ball here. And cleared out for a throw. forward to Shuttler. Off the foot of Rory Shuttler and it's going the other way. Intercepted here by Knighton. Knighton pushes through. The defenders converge on him and clear it out. Balls out of touch to Legends. Benton Reed battling here. Back out to Dashler. Plays to Shuttler who looks for an option on the left. Ooh. Tr on the skill, loses possession. That's going to yield to a long ball. Rush races for it, but Springfield's there and collects it. Two to one is the score here. Deschler challenges, balls out, rush throw. Throw in immediately stopped by Deschler. There was a great heads up play. Pushes through the defense. The tank that is low. Deschler on the cross. He's tackled. No call, but Deschler is still down. In a minute here. He's okay. Dashler gives a thumbs up to coach. He's going to play on. And we've got a corner kick here for Legends. Ball's launched in off the knee of the keeper. Rule had the position, just not the momentum to put a good shot on. He's still in the box here. Cleared out. Rush forward. Looks for a cutback to get through. And he is. Down the left wing, chased by Mara. And the ball's going to be out. It's going to be a goal kick for Legends.
night and looking for a way through. I was surprised how little pressure was given. Cleared out, stop by rule. Knight and chases the far side, both of the outfit throw. And subs coming on. We have number 10, Roderick Nolan, number 7, Martin Bouillette, number 99, Nico Flores Dotti. All coming on. Low Deschler coming off. Among others, I couldn't keep track of all of them. Nolan gets the legend out of trouble. Long clearance here. Uh, they're going to call a throw here. here for a rush but nobody's there Springfield follows the ball outside danger is still there Maroff looks to get his team out of trouble in the corner here plays out the hard way kudos there's a great example of legend soccer at work right there you could clear the ball out out of bounds and just give a throw in to the other team but by trying to dribble trying to use your skill to play out you give yourself the chance to move the attack now in this case it looks like we call a foul and we're going to have a free kick here for a rush one man wall with Adrian Mara shot goes in and off of Bouillette and it's going to be a corner kick Eighteen minutes remaining in this ball game, two to one Legends lead. Legends definitely known for more for their offense than for their defense. Can they either extend or hold this one goal lead for nearly twenty minutes? We'll find out. Throwing Maroff's got the ball left side. And subs coming on here for Rush. You may see that blur there in the middle of the camera shot. That is those where those two cameras meet. Uh, and then obviously the onboard AI is the one who's following the action but if you notice that blur that's what you're seeing we were we borrowed a camera ours is not arrived but it is on the way here's Knighton with the cross and a great cross there by Knighton but collected on the keeper so this rental is a little older and you may notice a slight dip in camera quality Ball makes it through the defense, is going to roll all the way to the end line for a goal kick. Nico, the clearance is blocked, and we'll be out for a throw. You have to figure these slight delays. Like a ball going long out of bounds are good for legends. Delay this game a little longer. Rush typically dependent on a successful long ball that takes a good bounce or something of that nature to score goals against le uh, against legends. But they do play very stout defense and half the day as they've only conceded two to a Legends team accustomed to scoring four or more in a game. And the ball goes out of bounds for a goal kick. So, uh, 
uh, immediately after this game, Scott Gallagher, who the Legends played last night, played Sporting Caw Valley out of Manhattan, Kansas, and defeated them 2-1. to one. So that will make, oh, we've got the ball in the net, but the flag is up for offsides. You cannot be beyond all the defenders without the ball. No cherry picking is essentially that offsides rule. And such was the call there. Sporting Call Valley will go into the game against these legends tomorrow afternoon. 0 oh, and 2, so they are effectively eliminated. Based on those results, two of the three remaining teams will play for the final. Scott Gallagher. Kansas Rush or your Kansas City Legends. Knight fights for the ball, cleared out here, and collected by the rush keeper. No one saw that throw all the way. Stops it off. Bouillet stops off again. Great pressure by Legends in this game. It's really made all the difference. Rush has had to really work for everything they've tried to create. But they find themselves really one strike of the ball away from a equalizing goal. Great skill there by Charlie. The ball's poked free and cleared out. There was the call. 13 minutes, 20 seconds remaining in this ball game. We have subs coming on. Adrian, Martin, Charlie coming off. I see and Luke. Z-Man, Benton, Rory coming on. Oh, Martin. What the body of Nico Flores' body is taking some punishment from the ball. Oh, Bouillet in front of goal shoots just wide. Martin Bouillet. He's a hurricane waiting to happen. But he has not yet struck the goal this game. forward. No one gives chase. Reed looks for a shot. Stopped off by Rush. Oof. The defender being worn out. Doing his best impression and Nico getting in front of two shots there. Stopped off by Reed. And the ball's cleared. Legends with a lot of pressure in that last minute. Rush beat the ball out of the net. For the moment, are still only down one. Twelve minutes remain in the ball game. Shot in the battles for the ball left side. Nolan fights through. Triple team. Balls out for a throw. Throw the center. Boo yet. Well, hold on. We got a. It's got to be an illegal throw there. I was busy watching what I thought was about to be a miraculous Boo yet goal. Oh, there's no one. Tripped up. No call. Clearance stopped. Really, that's been the story of the game so far, is Rush attempting to clear or long ball and interceptions just like that, just like Lil Deschler just did. Once again, puts it back in trouble. Here's Bouillette. Shot. Save. Off the foot of the keeper. And that one's going to be off of Bouillette and a goal kick. Get the ball away. Alex, open up, play him. No, no, 
About 10 minutes for Rush to find an equalizer. The current plan of launching the ball and hoping for a favorable bounce has just not really helped out. The back line of Legends has just been stout. Stopping. There's Benton Reed again. Takes a shot. Keeper clears. Nico Flores Dottie. It, it's, it's been the same thing just about every possession. Rush attempts to clear. Stopped by the back line of Legends. And then Rush is able to pack in and really kind of discipline defense in their own box. Reflecting everything that's coming at them. But that is not a recipe for finding an equalizer when you are down 2-1. Reed, long shot, bounces in front of the keeper. And the throw is long, and it's essentially here Carmine takes the ball, and Carmine says, no, you take the ball. The keepers overly generous to each other. And we'll have a throw. Martin Bouillette jockeying for position. Two seconds away from throwing that dude to the ground. Nolan takes the ball as he pleases. He's a bad man. Oh, Nico. Good idea. Save. Here's the throw. And straight to Springfield. Please, Carmine, take the ball. Carmine's kick gets through. Almost an open run there for Bouillette, but the ball's cleared out for a throw. About seven minutes remaining in the ballgame, still a 2-1 Legends lead. No one chases it in the corner, steals it, crosses it, stopped. Shuttler gives chase down the wing, ball's out of bounds. How was that ball going to rush? Yeah, Rory tries to pick it up, but uh, you know it happens. Oh, and then an illegal throw is immediately called, even though it totally wasn't an illegal throw. I appreciate that makeup call. Collected by the rush keeper. Six minutes remaining in the ball game. Ball is stopped. Now, you can't do that, Mr. Nolan. Uh, the keeper is entitled to enough space to get that punt off. Ball's going to be, again, out of touch. Not sure how it's Rush's ball. But somehow that's Rush's ball. An illegal throw is called again. You know, by hook or by crook, I guess. And now we got subs coming on. Yeah, Coach, you can tell the boys about the illegal throw, but I think it was getting called no matter what. It was Shuttler, left side, nutmeg. The nutmeg being when you kick the ball through the legs of your opponent. I have learned that from my son. It is not a cooking ingredient. Shuttler looks for an attack, but a little too heavy and it's out of bounds. Even though they are young, uh, and you think they can go forever, these boys do get tired. These last five minutes are very telling of who's been putting the work in. It's a war of attrition. Here's Maroff. It's 
It's got a shot deflected. Back to Deschler. Shoots just wide. Well, four and a half minutes to go in this ballgame. Ball challenged there by Knight and takes possession, plays out to Rory. Rory passes man left side. Easy, easy. Into the corner. Looks for a center. Ball's intercepted. Cut back now. Here come Rush on the counter. Challenge there by Maroff. He's passing, he keeps possession. Here comes Adrian Maroff down the left wing. Cuts back to the middle. Cuts back to the left. Not giving up on possession. Fights for it, keeps it. The ball's cleared, but a fantastic run there by Adrian Maroff. Rush need to find something here if they want to find the equalizer. About three minutes to go in the ball game. Two to one, Legends lead. The goal kick is long and speculative and hopeful, but it just leads to another legend goal kick. It feels like it's Hail Mary after Hail Mary, but they've been throwing them since halftime. Ooh, challenge here on own end and Knighton just clears it out. So Rush will take the opportunity to sub in here with about two and a half minutes to go in the ball game. Needing a goal to get that point. Would need two goals in this short period of time to try to get a win. As it stands right now, Legends would take a commanding lead on the group of six points if the results hold for the next two minutes. My co-host again is Bourbon. Corner is played to safety, but only for another corner. Short corner taken here by Rush. Cross goes in, or not even a cross. Falls wide, out of bounds for a goal kick, and Legends will take this opportunity to sub on Broderick Noland, Martin Bouillette, and Nico Flores Dotti. Challenged by Rule, but here come Rush. Ball's cleared out. Mara gets into the box, cuts back to the middle, takes a shot off the foot of the keeper. Fantastic shot there by Adrian. Happens to find the heel of the keeper and out for a corner. Less than a minute remaining in this ball game. You wait for the rep to blow that whistle when he feels it's necessary. Here's Rule. Here come Rush with the ball and what I assume will be the last opportunity they have on the attack. Need to find something here. Ball goes out of bounds. Legends throw. Stolen by Rush. Rush the ball here in the corner. Stopped off. Centered. Nico challenges, but Rush still have it. The danger is not done. Ball's out. Oh, no. Cleared out here. We're still in play. Oh, the call's a corner. Final corner kick. This to determine the game. If Rush can find the back of the net, they can get a point. Stopped off. Cleared out. Here comes Adrian. Pushes through the fence. Into the midfield. The ref checks his watch and blows his whistle. That's the final. Legends hold on. 
for an entire half to win the game 2-1 and take a commanding lead in the group in the Emerald Cup. Thank you everyone for watching. Please enjoy the rush coach screaming at the referee. Thanks everyone for watching. We'll see you guys tomorrow.